issue to me with uh, looking at Jimmy G is he always looks rusty to me. Um, I've noticed over watching him over the couple of years, he has a tendency to throw behind and hide his receivers. Um, I've never heard anybody really address his practice habits with regards to how much time he puts into working with receivers, but he always looks like a guy who just hasn't been working with those guys very much because he just doesn't seem to be in sync with them. It seems to me that if the 49ers had a quarterback, and I don't think they have to go bankrupt to go get Deshaun Watson, but if they just had a quarterback that could hit an open receiver, um, like I thought Matthew Stafford would be the answer, that would be the solution. Yeah, look, the, what I see from Jimmy Garoppolo is when he throws, he often doesn't set his feet. It's often all upper body. It's often all arm, which leads to inaccuracy. Uh, everything about him is he doesn't really pay attention to detail. He's a little sloppy. And I think the, he, his attitude is, well, I, w- I went 5-0 and when I came here and I didn't know the offense. Maybe I don't need to be as anal about the details as you, Kyle. Maybe I can go out and wing it and play the way I want to play and win. And Kyle, I think his attitude for years has been, you can't. You might have success for a little bit playing like that, but it's going to catch up to you. And I think you're seeing it. I think that's correct. And Jimmy Garoppolo is just a quarterback who got validated and paid, set for life after five starts. And when you do that, you just how – do, how does a young man keep – hold on to the incentive to improve when the entire organization has said, you're our franchise guy, you got it right now? Why would you pay attention to the details and care about – setting your feet and doing things by the book when you've been rewarded after just a glimpse and a glimmer of something. So yeah, I think that's who Jimmy Garoppolo is. He's always going to be slightly sloppy, kind of a tease. And if they could get someone who takes their craft more seriously, they should do that, Jim. Well, thank you, Grant. Thanks for coming on.